John twenty one sixteen Lege auto Palin Deuteron Simon Ioannou Agapas me Lege auto nai curie su oidas hati philose Lege auto poimine ta prabatamu So here we have this searching conversation interchange between Jesus and Peter, where I think it's quite clear that Jesus in, is intending for Peter to recall his three-time denial of Jesus, and now Jesus asked him three times, do you love me? So he said to him, we continue to see these narrative or historical presence throughout this passage, Jesus said to him again, a second time, Deuteron, Simon of John, right? Simon, son of John, that's a genitive of relationship right there. Do you love me? And then Peter replies to him, right? Peter says to him, uh, the, the subject Peter is implied, Yes, Lord, you know that I love you. We already spoke in the previous verse about my opinion that the variation between the two verbs, agapao, and the verb phileo, is just a matter of stylistic variation. I don't think there's a particular nuance. I know there are some commentators, especially some more popular commentators, who will disagree with that. You'll have to look at the evidence for yourself. And then we have Jesus replying here to Peter, Peter's protestation. You know that I love you. And then he said to him, that is, Jesus said to Peter, shepherd, from the verb poimino, to shepherd, to tend animals. Notice that's a present active imperative, second person singular. Shepherd my sheep. 